Welcome to a video tutorial for Active Inspire 1.5. Today I'm looking at inserting documents and saving them in my flip chart. So I've already got a page set up with what I want to teach and I have to support this a reading uh, and uh, an anticipated, anticipatory reading guide which is my handout to go with this. Now I would like to save this into my flip chart so that next time when I come to use this page I don't have to go hunting everywhere for, um, for the handouts. So my reading to insert this and highlight my link to the reading I'm going to go to all actions and in the top menu I'm going to use the drop down tool and I want document media actions. Now I want to open a document, file or sound, so I'm going to select that, then I go down to action properties and I click on the browser button so I can go and find what I want. Now I've saved these files just to my desktop just to make it a little bit easier, but you can save them anywhere, any folder, you just go hunting for them. There's my reading that I want, reading on ammonia, so I go open and then apply changes. Now this box comes up and I can store it externally or I can store the file in my flip chart. Now I want to store, store the file in my flip chart so that it comes up next time I use this um, flip chart. When I roll the cursor over that, that group there of, for the reading, you can see the blue arrow which shows an action is attached to that group. Now I want to attach the handout and I do that in exactly the same way. So I select my link. I go into my action browser, select document media actions to open a document file or sound. I go looking for the file I want. I've got it saved on my desktop and there it is there. It's my reading, anticipatory reading. So I open that and I will apply changes. Again, I want to store that in file in my flip chart. So I go OK. And now when I click on either of these, the handout will come up and that's just my and there you go